Hi friends, welcome to TurboMath channel. In this video, we are going to solve three questions about PEMDAS rule. In the first question, we have 152 minus 152 times 5, then over open parentheses, 18 minus 16 close parentheses, then all of them to the power of 2. What is the answer of this question? In this question, we have subtraction, multiplication, division, parentheses, and exponent. To solve this question, we need to follow the order of operations, which is PEMDAS. PEMDAS shows the priority of the mathematical operations and if you don't pay attention to this rule, you get the wrong answer. In this rule, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition and S stands for subtraction. Multiplication and division have the same level of priority, also addition and subtraction have the same level of priority. When we have both in an expression, we start from the left and simplify the question. Let's simplify and solve this question step by step together. We have 152 minus 152 times 5, then divided by open parentheses, 18 minus 16 close parentheses, then all of them to the power of 2. Okay guys, according to the PEMDAS rule, first we simplify the parentheses. Inside the first parentheses, we have subtraction and multiplication. According to the PEMDAS rule, multiplication has higher priority than subtraction. So, first we simplify this multiplication. Negative 152 times 5 equals negative 760. Now we have 152 minus 760. 152 minus 760 equals negative 608. The final answer of this parenthesis equals negative 608. Okay guys, now the question is negative 608 divided by open parenthesis, 18 minus 16 close parenthesis, then all of them to the power of 2. Now we have division, parenthesis, subtraction and exponent. Again, we simplify the parenthesis. 18 minus 16 equals 2. Now the question is negative 608 divided by 2 to the power of 2. In this step, we have division and exponent. First, we simplify this exponent. 2 to the power of 2 equals 4. Now we have negative 608 divided by 4. Negative 608 divided by 4 equals negative 152. The final answer of this question equals negative 152. Guys, if you want to get the right answer of this question, you must follow the PEMDAS rule. If you don't pay attention to this rule, you get the wrong answer. Let's solve another question about PEMDAS rule. Negative 8 plus 8 times negative 9 plus 9, then times 7. What is the value of this expression? In this question, we have addition and multiplication. Some people solve this question like this. They say negative 8 plus 8 equals 0. 0 times negative 9 plus 9 which equals 0 then times 7 0 times 0 equals 0 and 0 times 7 equals 0 They say the final answer of this question equals 0 but this answer is definitely wrong Let's solve this question step by step together Again to solve this question we need to follow the PEMDAS rule If you don't pay attention to the PEMDAS rule you get the wrong answer As you know in this rule P stands for parentheses E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. Okay guys, multiplication and division have the same level of priority, also addition and subtraction have the same level of priority. When we have both in an expression, we start from the left and simplify the question. According to the PEMDAS rule, in this question, first we simplify this multiplication. 8 times negative 9 equals negative 72. Now we have negative 8 minus 72 plus 9, then times 7. Okay guys, now we have subtraction, addition, and multiplication. In this step, we simplify this multiplication. 9 times 7 equals 63. Now the question is negative 8 minus 72 plus 63. Negative 8 minus 72 equals negative 80. Now the question is negative 80 plus 63. Negative 80 plus 63 equals negative 17. The final answer of this question 
equals negative 17. Guys, if you don't pay attention to the PEMDAS rule, you get the wrong answer. Let's solve another question. In this question, we have 1 plus open parentheses, 28 plus 4 close parentheses divided by 4, then times open parentheses, 28 plus 4 close parentheses. What is the answer of this question? Can you solve it? In this question, we have addition, parentheses, division, and multiplication. Some people solve this question like this. They start from the left and simplify the question. 1 plus 28 plus 4, which equals 32 divided by 4, then times 28 plus 4, which equals 32. Again, they start from the left and simplify the question. 1 plus 32 equals 33. 33 divided by 4, then times 32. 33 divided by 4 equals 33 over 4. 33 over 4, then times 32. 33 over 4 times 32 equals 264. They say the final answer of this question equals 264. But this answer is definitely wrong. Let's solve this question a step by step together. To solve this question, we need to follow the order of operations which is PEMDAS. PEMDAS shows the priority of the mathematical operations and if you don't pay attention to this rule, you get the wrong answer. In this rule, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition and this stands for subtraction. According to the PEMDAS rule, first we simplify the parentheses. Inside the first parenthesis, we have 28 plus 4. 28 plus 4 equals 32. Now the question is 1 plus 32 divided by 4, then times open parenthesis, 28 plus 4 close parenthesis. Okay, guys. Now we have addition, division, multiplication, and parenthesis. According to the PEMDAS rule, again, we simplify the parenthesis. 28 plus 4 equals 32. Now the question is, 1 plus 32 divided by 4, then times 32. Okay, guys. Now we have addition, division, and multiplication. First, we simplify this division. 32 divided by 4 equals 8. Now we have 1 plus 8, then times 32. Now we have addition and multiplication. In this step, we simplify this multiplication. Because the multiplication has higher priority than addition. 8 times 32 equals 256. Now we have 1 plus 256 and 1 plus 256 equals 257. The final answer of this question equals 257. Guys, if you don't pay attention to the PEMDAS rule, you get the wrong answer. Thanks for watching guys. To see more mass videos, subscribe to the channel.